No real change in the weather. All right, you guys saw it. You walk outside. It's what we expected it to be. Let's embrace it and have fun with it. All right. Have fun. All right. Second of all, let's start fast. Last road trip, right? We came with the right mindset. We can start fast. Let's start this thing fast. Number two. Most important, let's have the time of our lives. You guys have prepared your ass off. Now let's go play our ass off. Sound good? It's overcast. It's been raining off and on. The wind has been gusting, though it appears to have died down a little bit here. But it's a chilly November day here in West Lafayette. But this one is the Wildcats try to get to 4-0 and maintain their grip on the top spot in the Big Ten West. Coach just brought me the hot chicken broth, so we know it's good. Woo! Hey, you're going there. Yeah! Yeah! There it is. yeah. <laughs> Woo! Wildcats come into this game ranked in the top 25 for the first time this season and off to a 3-0 start for the first time since 2015. Hey, I'm going today, boys. Oh, Second time in 85 meetings, both teams, excluding conference openers, have been undefeated in Big Ten play. We're ready to go. The Wildcats and the Boilermakers. Week four of the Big Ten season. And we just can't say enough about Peyton Ramsey. He's done a terrific job bringing some stability in the quarterback room. And second down, Ramsey throws open. That's a pitch. Ramon Jaffeel Coleman. Games on days like this often tend to, to become ball security kinds of games. On the sweep, here's the guy who's so good in his spot. Spins for a first down. No score, first quarter. Counts on the drive. First and goal. Out to the penalty. The feet and throw to the end zone. That's caught for a touchdown. Ramon Joaquil Bowman. Fourteen plays, 75 yards, balanced attack. This Purdue offense, they have so many playmakers, and yes, no Rondale Moore tonight, but David Bell, week in, week out, he puts up numbers. Chris Bergen into the coverage, the Big Ten Defensive Player of the Week. Anderson in motion, they fake it to Horvath. O'Connell throws right, and here's Anderson. Anderson at the line of scrimmage is met and driven down by Greg Newsom, a junior from Chicago. Wind at his back, and that is up and good. Just get ready, okay? And don't be surprised when that ball comes to you when you're wide ass open. These guys are screaming down here now. Ramsey with time, tight window, and a catch. Across the 40, that's McGowan. A sliding catch made inside the 30 by Jaquiel Bowman. And this will be a 46-yard field goal try. 20th leg, and this one is good. Career best for Charlie Kuban. Fourth down, about a yard and a half to go here. Play fake, O'Connell's going to throw under pressure. Man wide open. It's caught by the tight end, Miller to the 2015-10-5 touchdown. We'll be all right. We'll be all right. Yes, sir. We'll be all right. 
Zero, zero, boys, let's go now. Set up the screen. That's caught. Charlie Mangieri, the tight end, hangs out of the ball and picks up. Western secondary has been a strength. There's anyone in the Big Ten Conference you trust matched up one-on-one. -on -one. We are seeing Greg Newsom answer the bell today. They're going to keep trying him. He certainly seems up to the task. You are playing from the front. You are playing from the front, not only recognize you're playing from the front in this game. They gotta chase you. They gotta chase you. We play our game, we play our style of football, okay? Wildcat football, one play at a time, we win this football game. Alright? Alright, let's go. Let's go to work. 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 Hey, I'm gonna kick into the wind to start the third quarter, which means we've got the wind in the fourth. Let's go. We gotta mulch some time, score some touchdowns, yeah. and get stopped. So well, we're going against the wind. And then we got the wind. Let's hit the gas and blow these guys. Yeah! We're coming here to send a fight song. Empty the tank. Went up three, one, two, three. Let's go. Let's go. Patty Fisher, he wasn't going for the ankles. He said, I'm going up top. Fifth carry for Xander Horvath, and he goes nowhere. Saunders on the stop. Still just one yard rushing. The guy coming in three straight 100 yard rushing games. Back to O'Connell, drops the throw, scrambling. Now he fumbles the football. It's picked up by the Wildcats. It's Patty Fisher running. Fisher cut down inside the 20 yard line of the Boilermakers. First place on the line, man. We've seen plays made offensively, defensively, takeaways, big hits. That's what you want. Snap to Peyton Ramsey. Ramsey will swing it out. It's caught by RCB. He's in again. The hat trick for Ramon John Keel Bowman. I wish I got three of them. 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 I got O'Connell throws, end zone, tight pocket, and incomplete, knocked away by Cam Ruiz. And so, Purdue creeps a little closer. It's an 11-point game, 3.45 to go here in the third quarter. Come up with this stop, game in over. Take quite the stranglehold on it with the way your offense is starting to eat up clock. It's Horvath. He'll cut back. Stood up at the 30. And Horvath is down. Oh, and he's going to get it. O'Connell now going to the left side of the end zone. Over the shoulder catch. Touchdown, Purdue. And the Boilermakers make it a one score game. So, last gasp here for Purdue. Third and seven, O'Connell, time, dead ends, O'Connell is down, and Kuliota. And that will do it from ross Aid Stadium. Nineteen ninety-six, the last time Northwestern before tonight began a season 4-0 in Big Ten play. Pat Fitzgerald talked about the feeling that perhaps something special is brewing here. Pretty win, man. Pretty win. 
Where's that Sky Team at? <laughs> Run wins in the Big Ten are hard to get, and we got two of them. Yep, sir. And guess where we're going? Back home.